Hi, today we are going to discuss about rotation of axis in two dimension. So, what is rotation of axis? It is the transformation of axis by rotating the box axis x coordinate and y coordinate by an angle theta without changing the origin. Okay, so we know uh, when we talk about anything, there will be coordinates exist or we can uh, define the location of any point with respect to some coordinates. That coordinates are known as axes. Okay, so let me represent this rotation of axis in figure. Let, let us take a point P and it is existing in a coordinate system. Uh, with the x axis and y axis if we find out the x coordinate the point p is meeting x axis at m and the y axis at q let o be the origin of this uh, coordinate system and ox om is the distance uh, x is the distance between om and y is the distance between o and q now we can represent p by using this values x and y that is p is equal to or p is x comma y so x and y is defining the location of the point p now let us rotate this axis to an angle theta and let x dash and y dash be the new coordinate or new axis and let us draw the perpendicular to OX dash and OY dash and it will meet at R and S. Let OR is the distance X dash and OS is the distance Y dash. Okay, so we can represent P again in new coordinate system as P, X dash and Y dash. So, why we have to provide this rotation of axis? We know for a curve, General second degree equation is ax square plus bxy plus cx square plus dx, ey and f plus f is equal to 0. And the term bxy, it is a term depending upon both axes. So we have to eliminate this term. For eliminating this term, we have to rotate the entire axis to an angle theta. Okay. So that is why we are providing rotation of axis. So, as I said before, P, X, Y is the coordinate of the point in the initial axis. P, X dash, Y dash is the coordinate of the point on the new axis. And we have to develop a relationship between X and Y and X dash and Y dash. So, for developing a relationship, <coughs> for developing a relationship between X, Y, X dash, Y dash, I'm going to draw a line from origin O to P. And the distance between O and P is R. Okay. So let OM is a distance X. OY is a distance Y. OR is distance X dash. And uh, OS is the distance X Y dash. Now from triangle OPM. This is a right angle triangle. So we can say cos entire angle. This angle is theta plus phi. So cos theta plus phi is adjacent side by hypotenuse here adjacent side is om so om by op okay so om is a distance x and op is a distance r so we can write x is equal to r into cos theta plus phi let us keep this as the equation number one now let us take again that same triangle sine theta plus phi is opposite side that is pm pm and divided by hypotenuse so pm distance is pm is equal to oq therefore pm can be written as y and op is r so sine theta plus phi is y by r and we can write y in terms of r and theta plus theta and phi as y is equal to r into sine theta plus phi so let us keep this as a second equation okay now let us consider the triangle O, P and R. This is also a right angle triangle making a 90 degree at uh, angle R. P, R, Q is 90 degree. So 
when we consider this triangle cos 5 is OR divided by OP. OR is a distance x dash. So, I can write cos 5 is equal to x dash divided by R. And x, can, x dash can be written as x dash is equal to R into cos 5. So, let us keep this as equation number 3. And again we consider the same triangle. Sin 5 is equal to PR by OP. PR and OS is of same distance. So, PR by OP can be written as Y by Y dash divided by R. So, from this we can write the fourth equation as Y dash is equal to R into sin phi. Now, I am noting down all the four equations. The equations are X equal to R cos phi plus theta. Y is equal to R sin phi plus theta. X dash is R cos phi and Y dash is R sin phi. Now, let me expand the equation 1 and 2. So, uh, cos a plus b is cos a cos b minus sin a sin b. So, similar way I am expanding cos phi plus theta as cos phi cos theta minus sin phi sin theta. Okay. Similar way y is equal to r sin phi plus theta can be expanded as sin phi cos theta plus cos phi sin theta. So, these are the expansion of the equations 1 and 2. Now, let me take the r inside this. So, r into cos phi cos theta minus r into sin phi sin theta. And y will become r into sin phi cos theta plus r into cos phi sin theta. Now, look at the equation 3. r into cos phi is x dash. So, I can replace all the r cos phi as x dash. So, here we have one r cos phi and here we have another r cos phi. And similar way, we can see r sin phi is y dash. So, we have r sin phi here in y and r sin phi in x, equation of x. So, I am going to replace all the r cos phi and r sin phi x dash and y dash respectively. So, x will become x dash cos theta minus y dash sin theta and y will become y dash cos theta plus x dash sin theta. Or just I am uh, taking the x dash as the first term. So, x dash sin theta plus y dash cos theta. Now, I can draw this with, uh, draw a table with this values. So, I am keeping x and y here, x dash and y dash. So, x is equal to x dash cos theta plus y dash into minus sin theta or minus y dash sin theta. And y is equal to x dash sin theta plus y dash cos theta. So, here we can derive the equation x equal to x dash cos theta minus y dash sin theta and y is equal to x dash sin theta plus y dash cos theta. Similar way, we can derive the equations of x dash and y dash from this table. So, x dash is equal to x cos theta plus y sin theta and y dash is equal to minus x sin theta plus y cos theta. Okay. So, we have derived the relationship between x and y in terms of x dash, y dash and theta and also x dash and y dash in terms of x, y and theta. So, let me note down all this equation. x is equal to x dash cos theta minus y dash sin theta y is equal to x dash sin theta plus y dash cos theta and x dash is x cos theta plus y sin theta and y dash is equal to minus x sin theta plus y cos theta. So, this will be the figure when we rotate an axis with an angle theta, both axis is rotated with an angle theta, then the relationship between x and x dash y dash and theta can be written as these equations. Okay. So, I hope you understand.